Hey guys, I'm Ryan Goodkin. I'm here with one of my friends, Liv, and we're just gonna talk a little bit about some of the things that people most frequently ask about. And today I was gonna ask Liv, she's a personal trainer, she's a fitness, a health and wellness expert, and I know she gets a lot of questions about simple things, even just like protein powder. So I was just wondering, you know, what do you typically hear? What are people asking you about protein powder supplements? So I feel like protein is just, you know, always takes the spotlight when it comes to working out, right? Sure. You know, everyone wants to know what they should eat after a workout, before a workout, right. and what their overall diet should consist of. So my philosophy is I'm extremely, I'm a great clean eater. I cook my foods every day. Yep. I'm very conscious about what I put into my body. Mm -hmm. And I try to preach the same to my clients and anyone that I come in contact with. Yep. So I, my thing is I, I'm not a dairy fan. So I really just stick to my proteins. I like them to be clean. I love good ingredients. I don't want a bunch of chemicals or junk in my sure. in my protein. Yep, I, I fully agree with that. So personally, I'm also dairy free. Um, when it, when I get to ask the question specifically about protein, I you know people say before or after a workout. I don't usually say one is absolutely better than the other, but I tend to say now though that people probably should look for a plant-based protein. Is that something do you agree with you? I would say so. Yeah. I just stray from whey. Like I don't ever eat right. anything that has whey in it. Um, right. You know, I just like to keep it clean. Like I said, it's yep. like I want to be able to pronounce the ingredients. I want yeah. to know what's in them. Exactly. And I want to feel good afterwards because if you're eating something that isn't quality ingredients, you're going to feel bloated. You're going to feel yep. tired. So those are all things I kind of look for. Yeah. No, I agree. I agree. The, the one of the plant-based proteins that I look for, I, I, I actually really like hemp seed. Oh, it, too. oh yeah, hemp seed's terrific. Uh, it's got a cool nutty flavor. Um, maybe there's a little bit of coconut oil in the, in the blend, but again, simple, everything that you can read and understand. There may be some pea or some rice to round out that plant-based protein content, but I, I, honestly, that's mine. I agree, I kind of avoid the whey, the whey protein. Uh, I just don't see that there's any added benefits. The plant-based stuff still has a full amino profile. So, and you know, digestion is always an issue. I mean, not always, I should say always, but people can sometimes struggle with, you know, having protein powders cause digestive distress or issues, right? So I just say, look, take it slow, start with small amounts and, and go from there and see what works best for you. Absolutely, I agree. Awesome, all right. Thank you, Liv, and thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe to my channel, at Ryan Livgood. Thank you and be well.